<sighs> okay guys, uh, today I'll be trying to fix um, again Logitech product. This time it is uh, G700, uh, once it was a flagship gaming mouse, now it's like an old mouse which needs some little bit of help. What is happening to it? Uh, it's left click is not working properly. Yeah, I will now explain why. So I push it down now and it's not working. So I push it down again and it breaks click. So it's like I lift the finger but I don't. It has sporadic. See? It doesn't work properly. I had the same mouse. I had a problem with right click. So when I was aiming with my sniper rifle during the game, it would break and it would cause a great fr frustration to me. So, the problem is simple to solve. You just need to take apart your mouse. So, you take your mouse, you turn it off, see? You have to remove this Teflon, but you have to remove it very carefully, so you can reattach it before you get the new ones. I can I uh, can tell you that it's best for you to buy new ones because when you re reattach these old ones it will never be so perfect as as new ones it will always be wobbly 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 you stick it to a clean surface and you start removing the second one, this one here, and little step by step, you will start to see screws. See, here, here, and here. So you have, I think, four screws. I don't remember. Yeah, Logitech has good product, but they have dumb engineers. They buy shitty components inside. And you have problems like this. As you saw in my earlier video, they had a problem with with the USB mouse receiver, the small one. So the solution is to fire a few engineers and I think the stuff will work, start working. So you take, uh, you have to take your battery out just in case, but we will start it with it so so you unscrew one screw try not to lose them second screw this is maybe boring but stick with me till the end so you will see what the problem is the problem is in this little piece of shit you see this is a micro switch can you hear it? This little shit causes the problem. I think there is a problem with dust inside or, or bad, bad component. You can slam it really hard and it will fix a problem. But the only solution is to remove dust from it or try or exchange switch resolder a new one get it on eBay or Amazon or I don't know where and resolder a new one they say they they fixed it with G 700 s model but I think that's a bullshit as it always is now it's very easy to open it you just pull it apart and it's like it's like made of nothing so you will you have to remove, you see, this part here. When you remove it, it will be a little bit easier for you to operate around the mouse. It sticks pretty hard. Yeah, it has two little, two little, mm, some like teeth that are holding inside. So you see, this is the problem here. This Omron Japanese micro switch. So I will... I will put battery inside 
I will restart mouse and I will show you how it on harder pressure it it moves but on soft pressure it doesn't you have to really stick it to the ground and it works with your fingernail I mean I can't worry you see when I really stick it with my fingernail it will always work it will not break contact so what you have to do is next you have to get yourself a can of compressed air and you just fire inside this fixed my problem earlier this year when my G700 failed so I wanted to make a new video that could help because this is a reoccurring problem in these devices so you just just air the shit out of it and hope that fixes the problem if not you will have to resolder a new part oh it still works uh, I have to turn it off but nothing will happen and put it on the nut this one so you don't have to in few months to open this one again. That's it. Let's close it down and see if we made any progress. Really? It works. It works very fine. And it doesn't break. Yes. See this Logitech? Next time do a better job with your mouses. I like your product, but it's sometimes a little bit shitty. Now again you put back your screws and you can now stop watching this video because this is totally simple to do. So you put back one screw, another and the stuff is over. I can recommend you to buy new Teflon uh, pads because these are, you will see, useless. Wash your mouse with alcohol or something like that and stick it back. Thanks for watching, I hope this helps you and uh, I'll post a little bit more videos uh, of fixes like this, these easy fixes that you don't have to spend another, I don't know how costly is this mouse, maybe 100 euros. And the, sim the fix is really simple. This is like 30, uh, this is like 5 euros. And uh, it fixes the problem. Screwdriver, you can find it anywhere inside your house. This is guitar uh, something that you play uh, your wires with. Let's call it guitar something. And the fix is pretty simple and easy. Again, I can prove that it's working fine. See? Holding works. Yeah, baby. Yeah. So, that's it. See you guys. Till next video.